Hey, what's up guys? Thomas Edwards, creator and author of The One-Up Effect, here to show you how to have fun becoming your most complete self. In this video, I'm going to share with you the three things of what I believe makes the good life. Now, if you're watching this video, chances are you've done your fair share of research around what makes the good life. And I'd like to share with you the three things that I believe make the good life with a little bit of research and science-based evidence that proves this to be true. But before I get into what makes the good life, I wanna actually make a clear distinction. You know, good and pleasurable and meaningful are three different words. And they're subjective, meaning you and your definition of meaningful and good and pleasure is very different than mine. But ultimately, in my opinion, a good life is not as fulfilling as a meaningful life. And so I wanna shift the focus and have us consider that the good life is actually the meaningful life. Now, what makes life really meaningful that can allow us to experience that level of meaning now, even in this moment? The first thing is your relationships, these meaningful, close connections that you have. Oftentimes we get so inundated with social media and we feel like we might have thousands of friends yet feel so alone. And the truth is you don't need a lot of people in your life to feel that social closeness and that tie. In fact, research has been done, I think it was a 75 year study uh, based in Harvard, and they found that one of the top things that allowed people to live a long lasting meaningful life has been those close relationships. Having close ties and those deep personal relationships has so many benefits beyond just greater happiness. You have an improved immune system, your level of cognitive function maintains and sometimes increases, your ability to handle stressful situations get better. But what I thought was really interesting is those who had gone through seemingly fatal illnesses were able to recover quicker and had a greater chances of, of recovery because of those so close ties. And so for me, relationships are by far the most important thing that can allow you to create a meaningful life. The second thing is fun. I believe one of the biggest things about living life is to be able to enjoy the life that you have and finding opportunities where you can have fun. Fun serves as not only a reminder as to why we're living life, but it actually has some really great benefits too. It opens up and it unlocks a certain part of your brain, you know, enhances curiosity, wonder, problem solving, leadership. It's a mood booster, it's a depression killer. I mean, there's so many uh, benefits around your wellness that play can come into, into effect. But one of the things that I thought was really interesting was when you have fun things to look forward to, it actually allows you to increase your serotonin and dopamine that gives you that energy boost to handle whatever tasks that you have in front of you in the very moment. Even if that fun event might happen either later tonight, tomorrow, later this week, or even later this month. And the third thing that I believe creates a very meaningful life is gratitude. Gratitude, if you see my videos, have tons of benefits. Increased brain matter, uh, better cognitive function. It's also an immune booster and a mood booster. While we are always very ambitious and we're striving for goals that aren't here yet, oftentimes we find ourselves forgetting about how we got to where we are right now. And looking at more absolute reference points and saying, man, I can't believe that you know, in just a few years or however long, I'm here in this place. It doesn't matter if this place right now is something that you're satisfied with or not. You can always find a worse situation that you've encountered or been in previously that can allow you to be grateful for where you are right now, even if the next mountain you're looking to climb seems really, really high. But the one key thing that gratitude does is it keeps you here in the present. Whenever we're going after goals, we're always thinking about the future or if we've already made decisions that you know didn't support us or didn't turn out the way we wanted to, we're always thinking about the past and we're looking at what we regretted, better decision-making, whatever, but gratitude brings us and keeps us here in the present, which is really where all of life unfolds before our very own eyes. And so to recap, the three things that allow you to live a more meaningful life, close ties and relationships, having fun and experiencing gratitude. 
But this is what I think. I want to hear what you think. Comment below. Let me know. Are these three things that you have in your life that you practice, you allow yourselves to come in? What are some other things that you believe can create a meaningful life? Please like, subscribe, hit that bell, get notified when we put out videos, which happen almost every single day. And if you want to learn the exact process and science behind experiencing personal fulfillment in health, wealth, self, and romance without sacrificing happiness or professional ambition, you can go to thomasedwardsjr.com. Once again, this is Thomas Edwards reminding you to make life a game that you can win and have fun playing. Until next time, I'll see you around.